Good morning and welcome to my Monday edition of Making It Work and starting a brand new week here. So let's get started with what I'm wearing this week. I'm just picking up stuff randomly. Um, first thing I'm using is the Brow Stylist Plumper Brow Gel Mascara by L'Oreal. And I could never read what color this is, but it's, it's like a light medium maybe. And it's got the long wand, which I love. And the short spoolie. Then I'm wearing my um, Ulta Eye Primer. Mascara, I'm wearing the Bare Minerals Lash Domination Volumizing Mascara. That's what it looks like. And there, it's got a spirally wand on it. For blush this week, I'm using my Milani uh, Rose Blush in Romantic Rose. And that looks like this. Very pretty. And for my highlighter, I'm wearing the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Illuminating Palette in... That's all it says, Meg, Mega Glow Illuminating Palette. And this is what it looks like. And I am using... Um, this mainly, this light kind of champagne-y looking color. Okay, for my palette this week I'm using the Gwen Stefani by Urban Decay. And the first color I'm using is called Baby and that's my base color. My uh, transition is called Harika, or Harajuku and that is this color here. And I am wearing Anaheim on my my lids today. This one here. So just a very light eye look today. And for my lips, today I'm wearing the CoverGirl O Sugar in Sprinkle. And that's the color 8. I had it right the first time, I guess. There we go. And this is what it looks like. And it's a, it says it's a vitamin-infused balm. And that's what it looks like. It's very pretty. Um, you have to build the color with it. But it's very pretty. I like it. And who doesn't need to wear a balm every once in a while? <laughs> okay, guys. I will see you tomorrow morning. Good morning, Bye -bye. and welcome to Tuesday's edition of Making It Work. Today I wore my Gwen Stefani palette. Isn't that pretty? It's just so pretty. And I got the colors wrong yesterday. Um, I was reading down here, and the names are actually up here. So um, the base color that I used is called Blonde. Just blonde. And the transition I used is Anaheim. Today I used Steady. And that is this color. So pretty. Just a real um, goldy brown is how I can describe it. Very pretty. And there is my eyes. A little bit darker than yesterday, but not a ton. And then on my lips this or today, I used my um, Big Sexy Lips lipstick and Lusty Rose, which, as you guys know, is the um, lip liner on top and the lipstick on the bottom, and it is gorgeous color. Such a gorgeous color. I really love this one. And it is in my Project Pan. I'm going to use um, at least one of the lipsticks for my Project Pan every week. So I get them used. And that is my makeup of the day. So I will talk to you in the morning. Good morning. This is Connie, and it is Wednesday. And let's get into what I'm wearing this or today. Um, I'm using my Gwen Stefani palette. And today for my base, I used Blonde, which is this color here. And for my... Excuse me, I have a hair or something. For my um, transition, I used Anaheim, 
just that color and I did something today that I rarely rarely do I used a matte for my eyelid and that is zone and I use this this brown here for my um, for my lid and I I rarely use a matte I usually use shimmers on my eyelids because I like it so anyway that's what I did for my eyes today and then um, for my illuminating palette today I went in with the more pinky shade for my illuminating and you can really you can I can see it on my cheeks it's too pink okay so darn it um, for my lips today I used a, a essence lip stick and it looks like this and it is in cool nude uh, 05 very pretty nude really um, I really love this color nude so that is it today for my face and I will see you tomorrow morning good Bye -bye. morning <laughs> welcome to my Thursday we've almost made it through another week uh, let's get into what I'm wearing today Gwen Stefani Urban Decay palette and as my base I'm using the color blonde right there as my transition I'm using the color Anaheim and I am using the color baby today this has got to be my favorite color out of the whole palette I absolutely love this um, it's a little bit brown it's a little bit gold it's a little bit bronze it's beautiful I absolutely love that color and they are so pigmented and um, buildable you know if you want a lighter shade go with a light hand if you want a little darker go in a couple of times it's gorgeous all right for my highlighter today since I'm using the multicolor or multi one from um, wet and wild I went in with the gold shade today and my lipstick I'm wearing the um, Burt's Bees lipstick absolutely beautiful it's color 501 uh, blush basin and this is what it looks like I really like these lipsticks really like the Burt's Bees lipsticks all right that is my Thursday I will talk to you in the morning bye bye Good morning it's Friday thank goodness it has been a week <laughs> I have been so busy. Um, yesterday I had to make a bunch of sandwiches, or like six sandwiches for our coffee shop, which is time consuming because I have to put them in little bags and, and label them and all that kind of stuff so they can sell them. And I had to do my salad bar, of course. And then I had to make 120 sandwiches. And that I had to shave the ham myself on the on the big old machine and make 120 sandwiches um, by noon today and I only got 38 sandwiches done so this morning is going to be nuts I wish I mean one of the ladies is out with influenza and she's out for 10 days and we're so short-handed and it's crazy around there so anyway enough of my woes um, you know I'm lucky to have a job I really am and you know this some time ago this would have all this pressure would have made me um, make up an excuse so I could stay home and I'm not doing that I'm going to work so maybe I'm improving a little bit <laughs> anyway this week I'm just gonna grab stuff my Ulta eye primer I'm still working on it months and months ago I said I was almost out right <laughs> Next is my Lash Domination by Bare Minerals Mascara. This is a good mascara. Um, it stays where you want it to stay, believe me. Next is my uh, Brow Stylus Plumper Brow Gel Mascara by L'Oreal in... It just says M900. 
Um, I love this mascara, or brow mascara. It's got the tiny stylus that I like, but it's got the long handle, which I love. And it's not too dark. It You can make it as dark as you want to. I use kind of a light hand with it. So it suits me. Suits my coloring. And I love it. I would repurchase that in a minute. Okay, for my um, blush this week, I used the Milani uh, Rom 01 Romantic Rose. Gorgeous, gorgeous blush. I love these. Of course, they never show up as well on me when I don't have foundation on. Um, you know, but... They still show up a little bit. So, and for my highlighter this week, I work wore the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Illuminating Palette in Catwalk Pink, and that's what that looks like. And I kind of went between the the first three. I didn't use the gold this week, this one, but I you I went between these three. And today I'm wearing this color, the kind of um, champagne color and I really like this illuminating palette um, I would repurchase that again too for my lipstick today I use the uh, covergirl O oh sugar in jelly and this is what it looks like very pretty um, they're very they are buildable but they're pretty sheer but I have underneath it my rock and rose uh, color by Jordana easy liner so this is more mauve. This was more purple. So um, as this wears off, I'll still have the lip liner on at least. But it's a very pretty color. Okay, and for my lastly for my eyes, I use the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani, Gwen Stefani by Urban Decay palette this week. And as I have all week, I used um, what's that called? Blonde as my base and I used Anaheim as my transition and then today I used Pop as which is a a very pretty um, champagne -y gold color and I mean I loved every shadow that I wore this week they're all very pigmented they you know they're very buildable they're very blendable and but the pop today had a, there was a lot of fallout on the pop color. A lot of glittery fallout. So I still, I have a few sparkles on my cheeks that I couldn't get off. But other than that, um, Urban Decay is one of my favorite, favorite high-end shadows. And this, you can really tell this is a, a it's weighty, it's, it's a good palette. It's weighty, it's pretty, it's got the Urban Decay logo on it. Very nice. I really like it a lot. Um, for my other lipsticks this week, I wore the other O Sugar, which was very pretty. I liked it. I wore my uh, their, their Big Sexy Lips. They're real. Um, in Lusty Rose, which I love. This is in my Project Pan. I wore my Essence. Um, this is a good lipstick. For the price, it's very good. And I wore one of my um, Burt's Bees lipsticks, and I love these. So I'm happy with everything this week. I, I thought I did some good looks. You know, a lot of the times my eye looks look similar, but I like that neutral look. I don't wear a dark eye or a bright eye to work, for sure. And I try not to get too crazy with my lipsticks. I've worn a few dark colors, but not... not too bad. Anyway, that is my week. I will see you Monday and take care. Bye-bye.